Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be organizing. Somehow, like always, my pantry gets a humongous mess. It looks like a bomb went off in here. My husband was actually mortified I was going to show you the state of our pantry, but this is just what happens. Our organizational system just doesn't seem to work. I have these big baskets, stuff just gets thrown inside and then thrown on top. It just, it hasn't sustained staying clean. So we are going to take every single thing out of this closet and start from scratch. After I wiped everything out, I took out those mats that were on the shelves um, and I also moved a couple of shelves around. The one that was in the middle that you saw in the beginning was really bowed because that's the middle shelf that was like eye level that we just put everything on. So I switched that shelf to the bottom. Here I'm talking to somebody. <laughs> um, and then I sprayed everything down with thieves and then I just put down plain contact paper. It was just something from the dollar store. I kind of wasn't planning on doing that. I didn't realize how dirty everything really was. Um, those mats were in there and I would always wipe them down every time I did the pantry over, but they've been in there for five years. It was time for them to be ripped out and a new fresh start. After I have everything all freshly lined now, I have a couple of these bins from the dollar store. I suggest if you are going to start completely over, I had a lot of these things, I grabbed a few things, but um, that you do measurements and you really kind of map out what you're going to do. I really wanted to use what I had on hand. I didn't want to buy too many things. I bought these three baskets from the dollar store and those two white baskets from Marshall's but I didn't end up using the white basket, so I just returned them. But in these bottom baskets, I thought those would be good to put the kids' snacks in because I want them to start packing their own lunches, which actually they just started this week, and it's good. I put something in each basket. I just tell them to take one thing from each basket. But that is our little plan of how we're going to keep it organized. It's just easy for the kids to reach in and see things and I just I really love the way it turned out it's just super functional and very clean I'm so excited let's just hope it stays nice and clean
that is it. I have everything figured out and how it's going to work for my family and so far so good. It's been about a week and it still looks awesome and super functional. Um, on this top shelf here, we just have like random dry goods and some canned things. We don't keep much of that stuff on hand, but just a few things. All of my baking goods and there's a few things there like olive oil and uh, beef stock. I made pot roast this week. And then I have some extra snacks that wouldn't fit in the kitchen. And there's our pasta, rice, mac and cheese, sweet potatoes, some garlic. And then here are the bins for the kids for their school lunches. They can take one from this bin, one from that one, and one from the next one that just holds veggie sticks. And then I have some big boxes of cereal down the bottom that wouldn't fit on a shelf. So that is it for today's video. If you guys like this kind of video and you like the organization and the motivation to get some things done around your house, I would love for you to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Have a good one, bye.